Alright guys, we got a nice news update that's coming out for both the JP and the global side of Dokkan Battle. Now the global side, unconfirmed, but sort of confirmed, but we're going to go over that in a little bit. As you guys probably have already seen, we have information, there's been a data download um, for the JP side of Dokkan Battle, and there was an announcement uh, for from the official JP Twitter. Now, I know you all probably already seen videos about this, but... We are getting the new Limit Breaker Goku, the one that was from the Super Special. Now, at the time that I'm recording this, it's currently 10.30 at night. Um, I, I was taking a nap, so I slept through the actual episode. But I'm about to jump on Crunchyroll. I know that they were experiencing some problems. But I'm about to jump on the Crunchyroll so I can watch the full one-hour episode. I'm doing my best to not be spoiled by it, so I will not be looking at any notifications or anything else on Facebook, Twitter, or any other social media, including YouTube, uh, before it comes up or before I watch it. But anyway, this new bad card is going is coming out for the jp side of dokkan battle and he is just a freaking badass guys like he's amazing we actually have some translations so shout out to ultra fancy giraffes over on the reddit for the translation and apparently you know he said he also gave his shout out for urine on discord so his leader ability is god category types gets key plus two hp attack and defense plus 120 percent or intelligence types key plus two hp attack and defense plus 40 percent now, to me, it sounds like, well, obviously, it's not, this is undokan form for level 100, so he's going to have a, you know, a dokan version, or he should have a dokan version, and if that's the case, it's probably going to be a flat-out boost of 150 across the board, at least that's what I'm thinking, um, so I don't know who's part of this category, apparently, um, apparently, as you see this comment here, uh, why is Bardock part of it, so apparently Bardock is part of the god category, <laughs> I don't know why, but I'm assuming that's going to be, like, Beerus, Whis, Weerus, like the Fusion Weerus, uh, the God Gokus, the Super Saiyan Blue Goku, uh, Vegeta, stuff like that. And then you're probably going to have Jiren, honestly guys, if Jiren, when Jiren gets a card, he's probably going to be part of that as well, or I think he already has a card, but if you don't, he doesn't have a card. So Jiren, Jiren's probably going to have it because he's on par with the gods. Uh, and there's probably a couple other people, like that. maybe we're going to get some cards from the other gods of destruction from the other universes. I mean, uh, Zamasu is probably going to be part of that as well. Uh, there's probably going to be a whole bunch of other stuff that's going to be part of it. Obviously, Merge the Masu, Zamasu, Rose. So that's going to be freaking really damn cool. This team is actually going to be pretty damn legit. Uh, his super attack deals immense damage, um, as we typically would assume, and he increases his own attack. I'm not sure if that's just going to be, you know, a flat out. Every time he does a super attack, it, he will increase his strength forever. Or if it's going to be like a one time, inc greatly increases his attack for one time. But what it looks like, it just, it, it, his own attack gets increased and there's no restriction on it. But we won't know till later on. This is just what we have right now. That's what I'm assuming. Anyway, passive skill is 70% chance or 70% increase for attack and defense. And key plus three when HP is 50% or below for seven turns. Um, attack plus 70% increase and high chance to dodge attack. I don't know exactly how that pass is actually going to work. Uh, so I'm assuming... Now, I, again, I don't know. This sounds like when HP is 50% or below for the first seven turns, uh, you give yourself an HP and attack... Uh, or sorry, HP... Um, sorry, defense and attack increase of 70% and key plus three. Which that kind of sucks uh, if that is the case. But I, I, I don't know. Uh, and then attack plus 70% increase and high chance of dodge attack, I guess, makes up for it. So I'm assuming that's actually what... It's probably pretty damn decent, and it, this is probably going to go to 80% when he gets Token Awakened, if that is the case. His link skills are Kamehameha, Prepared for Battle, Godly Power, Over in a Flash, Tournament of Power, and the First Awakened. So, that's actually pretty cool. He's a decent, decent link skill set. Um, Kamehameha is flat-out boost, Prepared for Battle is a key boost, Godly Power is a flat-out boost, I think, of 1,200%. I think that was changed to a 10%, though, like a percentage-based. Uh, Over in a Flash is a key, so he has five key between the two of them. Uh, between the two uh, key link skills and the tournament power i forgot which one that was or like i know i think it was an attack increase but um and then the first wait waking i believe is an attack increase as well and his category um like there's two categories that he's part of is universal survival arc and godly dimension Ta -da! that's pretty cool you know he's a pretty damn badass card i like him so let's go back over here to the twitter and let's just take a look we do have a super attack <laughs>
So that is a pretty legit uh, super attack. It reminds me of the Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta that um, uh, that does his, when he does a super attack, how they kind of fade out. I think they're just like one animation like screen like less than like with the, with the fading of the character. Overall, pretty damn cool card. Really like it. I, I think he's out right now from what I was reading. I didn't log into the JP side yet, so I know I missed my five dragon stones for the special. Uh, kind of upset about that, but whatever. What can you do? Um, I'm pretty sure he's going to be out soon, and we should hopefully have a Doken version of him soon as well. Now, the other thing I did want to state, um, well, we already went over the stat. Apparently, apparently, in the global database, officially for release, is the Super Saiyan 3 Angel Goku. Now, I don't know where this came from. Apparently, this is like from the, the French side of... <laughs> sorry about that. French side of Dokkan Battle. But apparently, he is going to be the next one that's going to be released. So, mad hype for that. Um... I, I'm really hoping that I have, you know, I don't, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do any summons on this banner, uh, just because I went really ham on the intelligence banner, looking for that LR Gohan. Um, so we'll see what happens. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna have to really evaluate what I'm gonna be able to do for the next couple of months. I might have to wait for the intel, the, the actual Gogeta banner. But uh, yeah, guys, that's it. Stay hype. The data download is. Apparently going to be is available as of 13 minutes ago. I log I didn't actually log in from the past 13 minutes. So, uh, but yeah, that's awesome. The new Goku is here and he's freaking super super freaking hype. Uh, anyway, guys, let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. What do you think his leader ability and passive skill is going to be when he gets Doken Awakened? Because we don't have that as of yet. Um, and remember to subscribe if you're new here. Uh, also, punch that like button because the more times you know you you punch the like button for me. The more I come up in other people's recommended videos, and then I get more subscribers, and it helps me out with my channel. I really appreciate it. Anyway, guys, thank you for joining me here today. I'll catch you down in the comments below. And also, let me know what you guys thought of the Dragon Ball Super episode. I'll come back and check the comments after I watch it.